when it comes to Leinster against Munster, it's not about you know Jonathan Sexton and Ronald Gar. It's about you know us trying to do what's best for a team. And you know, just because one player you know plays better in that game doesn't mean that you know they're they're dead cert either. And a, a lot of it comes down to how your forwards play on the day and how the guys outside you like do. So you know, as an out half, I suppose you're reliant on everyone arranging and they're reliant on you and. Um, you know, I think that's important for everyone to sort of keep in mind. Uh, they're obviously, you know, th th our toughest games of the season. You know, uh, our current form is, it hasn't been very good, so you know they'll probably be coming into this game as favourites, and you know, uh, it's, a, it's a must-win uh, for us anyway with the form we've been going through coming into the Heineken Cup. So, um, you know, everyone's looking forward to it. It's a change of venue here in the Aviva, and everyone's really looking forward to that. So, uh, hopefully, we'll, it'll make for a good game. You know, it's going to be a brilliant atmosphere, and uh, like Munster Leinster games always are, and um, you know. The lads are really up for it, I think, this week. It's a good rivalry, you know, it's a, it's a tribal thing. You know, whenever you play any of the provinces, uh, you've got lads who have, you know, been playing with their, their prospective clubs for, you know, since they were young and have, have really come through the systems and, and, you know, give everything for the club and, and you know, they don't give an inch in the pitch, you know. When you play with them in Ireland, it's a, you know, they'll do the same thing for their country with you, you know. But, you know, when you're against each other, you go hammer and tongs, but it's, it's all done and dusted afterwards. But... Um, yeah, no, it's, it's, we're looking forward. It'll be tough. You know, it's Munster. You know, they got big boys in the pack, and they got some back guys in the backs who can play ball. So, you know, they, they've, they, they punish guys who make mistakes, and, and they can create a lot of quick ball, which uh, can damage us as well. So, if we can get ourselves right and focus on ourselves, hopefully, we can cause them a couple of a couple of problems. The, I find the key the key to it is possession. Probably, you know, you get possession and retain the ball a lot in their half. You can. Um, it can, you know, cause a lot of penalties. You know, get a lot of decisions your way, especially if you generate a lot of quick ball. Um, the way the the rooks are being interpreted, it's 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 very hard for the defence to take the ball off them. I, I was fit all pre-season and, and and flying it, and then uh, you know, just before the Cardiff game, uh, I just probably overdid the kicking during the week and and sort of tweaked the muscle in the warm up, and then tried to get back quickly from it and you know probably didn't do it any favours didn't give it enough time and uh, you know then I'm under pressure now for this week but uh, you know it's feeling quite good at the moment We, we have a, you know, a couple of lads who, who are starting to really come through uh, you've got Dominic Ryan who's coming through you've got uh, Reese Rudder Key Madigan you know Owen Sheriff uh, Paul Ryan you've got loads of lads who have come through in development so those guys who are still in the academy like Madigan and, and Dominic Ryan who are doing you know, a great job and uh, you know they're 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 kind of bringing different ideas and different approach as well and, and you know, putting the pressure on people that have been around and, and, and it's good, you know, uh, the competition kind of brings out the best in everyone, I think, and kind of pushes the squad in general forward and, and brings our standard up, which is, can only be good.